Moon Hoax conspiracy founders Rene and Casing often complained that the photographs taken by the astronauts from the moon were just too perfect. Perfectly focused, centered and leveled, perfect exposure, and that this indicated that the missions were all fake. I don't know what it is about taking pictures under similar conditions on the Earth that would make them look any better than they would if they had been taken from the moon, but let's have a look at some of those perfect pictures that these people say prove the Apollo missions were all fake. As you can see, not every picture taken was perfect. They are out of focus, badly exposed, tilted. These are not popularly known because they're not very good photographs, but they are in the archives if anyone wishes to find them. And there are many more that are as bad or worse than these. But I think I was able to gather enough of them to make the point that if authenticity is predicated to some degree upon imperfection, then these gentlemen seem to have established their credibility. Oddly enough, it was these same hoax theorists who told us that the poor quality of the live video transmissions was reason to believe that the missions were faked. So to follow the logic of Casing and Rene, if your pictures are too good, that's evidence of fakery. If your videos are too poor, then that's evidence of fakery. Sounds like a classic heads I win, tails you lose proposition to me. And what kind of person is it that makes a deal like that? Well, it's a con artist.
thanks guys. You'll be remembered.